Okay, so there's a lot of, I don't want to say confusion, that's not true, there's a lot of stuff happening. Uh, here's the thing, um, how do you approach this? Look, let me, let me do it this way. Um, it's like, a, it's, okay, the Purple Rain film, you know, came out in 84, whenever it came out. Uh, the, Purple, you know, the, the Prince uh, film. Now, battle, basically, it's a film, well, it's a Battle of the Bands film, let's put it that way. Um, and so you know, have uh, 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 one band called Prince and the Revolution, or yeah, the Revolution, rather, the Revolution. Then you have uh, the Time, and then you have uh, De uh, the uh, uh, the Des Dickinson band. What's the Des Dickinson band called? I forget what's called. Uh, something Modern Airs or something like that. I forgot. Sorry. Uh, and so there was Battle of the Bands thing. Now, if if uh, as people may may not know. Uh, I'm a, a, a Prince uh, appreciator, okay, uh, like that, and uh, I did a, maybe I'll listen to the thing, uh, I did a thing after he passed, I did a thing with Steve Marshall, who was also, well, he's a Prince aficionado, and uh, maybe explain that to you there, maybe I'll list it uh, below. Uh, but, uh, but if you was to, if I was in one of those bands, let's put it that way, uh, I would be in the time, okay? That's the, the, the basic band I would be in. Now, if we had to, uh, 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 but if I was invited to hang out with, you know, the revolution, sure, I, I could hang out with them in, in, in you know, in, in regular times, you know, this this broad, whatever it is. But if we had to go into the trenches, I would be with the time, okay? Now, let's try to make this uh, analogy or this, this coupling, whatever this is, what I'm, whatever, whatever I'm trying to do. Uh, basically, I was born in South Bronx in New York City, okay? Now, in the era and whatever time I was born in, I wasn't born in what's called a segregated time. I mean, we were, my next door neighbors were white, next door we were uh, Puerto Rican. The, the whole South Bronx, or the Patterson Project, I should say, my Haven section, where the Patterson Project specifically was totally integrated. The only, only, time, only thing we had was uh, the, the as, and en masse, like the, the, the Jewish kids were up on the concourse, you know, so we all met at school, PS31. Um, so, so the thing is, uh, so I'm saying it was a totally integrated neighborhood. So my orientation is not necessarily uh, black. Don't, don't get me wrong. I'm black, of course, and and I grew up in a very political time. You know, whatever happened, it was following uh, Malcolm X and James Baldwin and Lorraine Hansberry like that. We wasn't necessarily following the Southern Southern cats, Southern Christian leadership conference and all that stuff. Okay. So, um, but if I but. But when we, when the 60s came along, you know, I mean, it's just really into the black political scene and, and the black arts movement and all the rest of that stuff. Now, in this time, if I was going to go to war, let's put it that way, if I had to go to war, and you asked me to join the, say, the, the revolution faction, or the time faction, or the modernaires, I think I'm calling the modernaires, there's the kids band, the modernaires faction, I would choose the time, you see, because that's, that's, that, that's where, I, you know, I feel most comfortable, uh, even though I'm exposed to all these other uh, great things. But that's where that's where my fight fight would be. So now let's make the other joke. So what I'm saying right now is that in uh, in, in in the best of times, probably you know the Prince Band all you know would be the the, the best thing to be in because you learn a lot, blah 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 blah, blatter, whatever have you. But in times of war, <laughs> you have to get down. Even though I appreciate that I can hang out with the Prince band, you know, with the with the Revolution, or I can hang out with with Des Dickinson's band. Uh, in times of war, when I got to get down, I would have to go with you know, with with the band of brothers. You know, I mean, I'd have to go with uh, you know, with, with the time because that's the kind of music I would go. So it's the same thing here for black people. Then these times for me, uh, yeah, I could send some support to. Uh, uh, you know, American Indians, lend some support to women, whatever, whatever, whatever these other, what other groups are. But that's not, well, that this is the times of, of extreme war. So even though I might appreciate those cats, you know what I mean? My troops, I got to hang out with black people. Specifically black people, when I say black people, I mean when I say black, I mean folks have been through the Middle Passage. I don't mean any other kind of black. Don't, let's not confuse that. So black people from the United States, from that experience, that lineage, that's that is the core. That's who I'm concerned with. That's that. In this, 
that's that, that's that's the lane I have to be in. These other folks, you know, they want me, they want to recruit me or recruit, you know, black people to their cause. They, you, you know, well, that's fine. We, we we support you. You know what I mean? But our fight is here, and we got to clear up our fight before we deal with the, uh, the I don't know, immigration, whatever, whatever's out there. Um, so that's the, the that's that's the thing. In an extreme time of war, I'm not even concerned with with necessarily with who the enemy is. You know, I say the enemy. I mean, you know, with with, with the Donald and his boys. I'm not particularly concerned with Schlatt, but but I'm not going to uh, fight with them when I know all these other groups are fighting with them. I have some other things to fight with. You know, I got to clear up, say that. Uh, well, well, I'm going to get into the Democratic Party. You know, but I got to hang with with, with not, not even the, but some people call progressive, not progressive. I got to hang with the black radicals. Let's put it that way. <laughs> or, or the black people that's thinking straight. You know, that's what I'm going to say straight. That's the fact. Or uh, black folks who actually know the analysis and been in the struggle for a while, not just Johnny come lately, who want to recruit everybody to their cause. It's an elite group, if you want to put it that way. I won't say elite, but it's an elite group. That's what I'm, I'm concerned with. And that's what I think that uh, black folks should be concerned with your elite group, progressives, same thing. I don't have to pull, uh, I, I, I don't want to, I want to be dealing with any other issue but that because that's how I stay focused and that's how it, the, things get done. So, that's it. I've been thinking about this, heaven on my head, so I had to get it out. Uh, I being T from the Pattersons, taking the train to Tibet, letting you know what I only suspect.